name is Phoebe Chepkemeilokwe. I'm the first born in a family of four. In class eight, I scored 399 marks and was the best girl in Uspokot County. So I made it to Alliance Girls High School. When I went to Alliance Girls High School, I experienced a diverse set of people people from every place in this country. It was a good experience getting to know all those people, interacting with all those cultures. I had a short concentration span, so I would study just for two hours. I would make sure whatever I read within those two hours, I never have to do that again, because I knew with that kind of concentration, I could not keep on redoing my work. I scored an A of 82 points, that is in 2016. I was among the 141 is in the country. I was invited to join the equity leadership program. I remember I was called by a lady from Kiku Equity Branch. I was really glad on that day because I didn't know how I was going to spend the remaining time before I go to university. I was taken by my father to Kasarani Sports View Hotel. Uh, it was a nice experience. I got to know that these students who performed really well were not only good in academics, but they had many other talents. I got to learn about the fact that I could apply to a school in the United States of America. While there, we met chaperones who were going to attend school in August and they were going either to Canada or the United States, and I knew at that time that I could also try. I remember James Mwangi, he told us of his history, how he was moving from a different organization to equity. That organization used to pay him more than what he was going to get paid at equity. But when he saw what he could do for equity, he decided to move from that organization to equity, and I now can see the fruits. It was a good decision. The art of pleasing a customer helps to develop a huge strength you, you need for the rest of your life called patience. You'll be developing emotional intelligence. Applying to universities abroad is not like the application where we do in Kenya. Universities abroad measure more than academics. You have to, you have to be an all-rounded student. So at that time, I had to study for my SATs and also for my subject tests, which I took biology, chemistry, and math. After that, there's the common app, where it's a portal where all applications are made. I sat for my SATs in Eldoret and posted all my results. The outcome came at 1 a.m. on 15th. I received an email that says that it gives me a link towards where I can click and get my results. So I clicked and I saw congratulations, you've been admitted to Brown University class of 2022. I ran around the house screaming, woke everyone up, people were wondering what's wrong. Why I chose Brown, you get to study the liberal part of education. You can do art, music, psychology. Then afterwards you can now go and do medicine. So it gives you the chances to study both arts and the sciences. I would like to study medicine. One thing I realized with Phoebe was uh, she was not all that uh, somebody who studies a lot. But the one thing she used to like is uh, reading novels. I would get her just uh, in one of the corners within the house uh, reading a novel every time. Very quiet, cold somewhere, reading a novel. And that one actually culminated to her well performance when she was in Standard 6. And that was when she started reading small novels like Progressive English, A, Progressive English B, those are the kind of novels I used to, to bring home. The community where we come from is a, a community with very few people who have gone to school. And in fact, she is the first one who has qualified through job to go for medicine in this community of Pokot, especially East DRT. So the community at large are really longing for the time when she qualifies to be a doctor to come and treat people around. I really appreciated the work that the, the equity has done to sponsor to study abroad. Phoebe is a very focused and hard-working girl and um, she's also a person who dreams very big. In the course of teaching physics, in Form 3, I happened to move around while we were having a lesson. Uh, I looked at her exercise book and something caught my eye and she had written Dr. Phoebe Lokwe. I saw a girl who is determined, focused, a girl who is dreaming big. You guys are in the best school in the country and so 
you should be dreaming of bigger things. Start dreaming Harvard, Yale, those places, MIT. So I'll be going to Brown University and it's a really good school. If you work hard, you can also get into equity leadership program and also get a chance to apply to schools. I'm just glad to hear that you guys did so really well. I look forward to become like you in future. I was posted at Gate House Nakuru branch. The inquiries during the day, I have to answer the same same questions from morning to evening and pick phone calls. So I have learned to multitask a lot because sometimes I'll be like this, speaking to someone from contact center or another person in the branch while I serve customers. You can get customers who will not be too friendly with you, but I'm grateful because I had the grace to be polite to them and still manage a smile even as I serve them. I'm thankful to the Equity Group Foundation. I'm grateful because of the chance I had to apply to universities in the United States because that improved my dream. It made my dream bigger.